Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing really, really well today. And if this is the very first video of mine you are watching, I hope you enjoy it because you have landed on a very special one. It is my biggest B&M and home bargains haul I have ever filmed on this channel, I'm telling you. It's gonna be a great one, so stick through and watch because I have crazy amount of stuff, oops, <laughs> that I think you guys would really, really enjoy. And another reason why this video is very exciting is because it is very kindly sponsored by ShopTagger. And I've been using ShopTagger for around two years now, so I'm very excited to be working with them again and telling you guys all about them if you have never heard of it before. ShopTagger is essentially an online money-saving tool that is completely free that you can use on your desktop or on your mobile phone through their app. And I've used it so many times to save myself money on clothes I buy for myself, the children, any homeware items I get for the house, and presents. Oh my god. The amount of times I've used their little personalized um, section where I have the names of the people I'm buying presents for and I save anything that I want to buy them on there in case a discount code pops up or my favorite part when it's on sale as much as I enjoy shopping I enjoy it way more when I get a discount code on the item I want to buy or when it's on sale who doesn't if you're a bit like me and you're constantly shopping online who isn't at the moment now that shops are closed and you notice that a lot of times the items are out of stock because they always are for me i don't know about you guys especially on h&m so shop tiger lets you know when something comes back in stock it just makes it so much easier to shop online so i've ordered a bunch of clothes for the children for spring from h&m i'm going to link a few of them down below if they're still available but if you do like anything and it's out of stock just save it to your shop tiger it will notify you when it comes back in stock once you click the link below you'll get to this page download shop tiger and then make yourself an account which doesn't take long at all then you'll need to install the shop tagger button so you can save your items this is super simple to do just click add to chrome and then add to extension this little button on the top right hand corner will appear and this is what you'll use to save your items and now you can go ahead and browse through thousands of online stores i'm gonna head over to one of my faves at the moment h&m and I've been eyeing up this a beautiful rug for some time now. I'm going to save it so ShopTagger can notify me when it goes on sale. To save your item, all you need to do is click the blue button. You can choose the size as well as when ShopTagger notifies you. Once the item goes on sale, ShopTagger will send you an email or a mobile notification. And you can also organize your items into personalized lists. These are the lists I've created to save my items in and it really helps me to stay organized as well as shop mindfully rather than just buying everything and anything. So ShopTagger has this smart feature where it actually scans the internet for coupon codes saving you having to do it. So when purchasing anything you can simply add it to your basket head to checkout and ShopTagger will automatically scan and find you coupon codes and today I have saved myself five pounds. This is a special feature on desktop so the Chrome extension is a must. You can now actually earn money whilst you shop online through ShopTagger through their new cashback feature. Head to the cashback section, shop through the selected stores and you can start earning money through PayPal whilst you shop. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave the link to ShopTagger in my description bar below for you guys. Now, so my battery died, I had to go change that. So if you notice a bit of a change in the setting, that's why. So I'm gonna tell you guys the categories we have. Yes, we have categories, is that serious? <laughs> we have food, we have cleaning items, we have beauty, we have kitchen organization, which is my favorite part. I'm very excited to show you that bit. Um, we also have decoratives and children toys and learning bits if you want to call it so let's get started with food because that is number one in everyone's life at the moment okay so the first thing i have i've already tucked into is this i don't know if you guys ever noticed this in home bargains but it's uh, 97 calories for a bar not bad on sugars not bad at all but this is what it looks like they said we're all here for the snacks it's coconut and chocolate guilt-free delight that's how it looks if you want to pick it up from home bargains this is so delicious honestly so you get five bars in here and should we have one go on then you guys keep the haul not the mukbang so very nice if you guys watch my vlogs regularly 
you would have seen that I showed this bottle. It's from Home Bargains. I still get questions on Instagram. It just has the time of day, so it really motivates me and pushes me to drink more water. The next thing we have is five pack of John West tuna. <laughs> In tuna chunks, to be specific, that's my favorite. And I do like the one that has no oil, that's already been drained, but we can't have it all right. So I don't know how much this was, maybe three pounds, and you get five. And something I'm using right now to put my memory card into and have a pair of lashes here is also from Home Bargains. Um, you get a pack of five for this and it's only like two pounds I think. And look at it guys. I haven't lost any lashes since I bought this. My memory card have a home for it to go in. I have one pair of lashes. I'm gonna take these off and put them there. You can put so much in here, so I have one specifically for memory cards, one specifically for lashes but since this was next to me, I thought I would show you. You get, I think, four of these for a pound, 99 pence. And then we have onion rings. Onion rings? <laughs> we have crispy onions. Who doesn't love a bit of crispy onions? I know I do. Sprinkle it on your food and you get that delicious crunch. So nice, I have this on my burgers when I make burgers, on my wraps. You know that viral TikTok uh, wrap hack? I always put this in there, oh, you get that. I love um, crispy onions, I love making my own, but also love this for convenience sake. And then we have three packs of honey roasted peanuts, which look like that. Also from Home Bargains, and I really like this to add into my stir fries. And we're gonna go into stir fries next, okay? We have, you guys are going to know how obsessed I am with this um, item right now, okay? I had more, I had like four more of these ones, these are my favorite, they now stock them in home bargains too. Um, so once I went in and they didn't have the stir fry one, spicy stir fry, which looks like that, I bought two of these, Tom Yum ones, which I haven't tried yet, so I can't tell you, but they don't matter. Okay, they don't matter. This is the plug right here. This is the one. If you want to try amazing noodles, you want to try this, but you want to follow my recipe. You can't just make it any old way. Actually, I've tried it the regular way. It's also nice. So the thing that makes them nice is the spice and the oil that comes with it that's it <laughs> i'm gonna do a little um reel on my instagram so make sure you follow me on my instagram i can leave it here so you guys can see what it's all about i'm gonna do a reels uh, where i show you guys how i make my stir fry noodles using packet noodles it's so nice so so nice i don't know how much it is though sorry and then saw this in bnm yesterday these are my favorite walkers max strong jalapeno and cheese and they are extra hot so I don't just sit and eat this, I put it in my food. <laughs> I am not one that can handle spice, I'm very not good with spice, so I like this, very delicious. And more evaporated milk, because I like this in my tea. I have seen people use the one that has cardamom included in it, but I'm not that elite, because I don't have Middle Eastern shops next to my house, so if you know where I can buy it in Manchester, please let me know, I'll travel. I'll drive anywhere and get it, but I've never tried that before. Is it good? Let me just show you this first because it's so beautiful. <laughs> so this is a the thing that you put um, wax melts. I don't know what they're called now. I liked the look of it. It looks so sleek. Have you ever seen them like that before? I haven't. And this was three pounds. Love it. So this is stackable fridge storage baskets, which look like this. I bought from b and m and they are so good honestly look at it so you can stack them up if you have a big space in your fridge like that and keep going but the way i'm going to use this is two and two like that can you see so one is going to be for blueberries um one is going to be for strawberries one is going to be for grapes and one is going to be maybe those tubit yogurts and my other yogurts that the kids like to have so the reason why i bought these are because um i buy fruits and recently since we've been in lockdown homeschooling all of that i have been hearing snack please i'm hungry feed me 24 7 
I've started to do this thing where as soon as I come home from shopping, I wash all the strawberries and I put it in a container at the moment. So now I have this, I don't need to do that. I wash all the blueberries, I put it in a separate container. And because I've been doing that and using it on my Tupperware, I thought I'll just buy this and do that. So when the kids are peckish and they want a snack, get themselves snacks and they don't need to mess about with water because that's another thing I don't like the kids messing around with water so they won't need to mess around with water everything's washed fresh clean and they grab themselves snacks so these are amazing you don't have to use them in the fridge by the way you can totally use them in cupboards but the next items I bought is for my cupboards so these if you look at the photo let me just get a photo of them guys looks like this you can totally use it for sauce it says sauce tray but i've seen that people have used it for potatoes in here for their herbal teas for pasta and so on not open pasta things you have in your bags i'm going to use one of them for potatoes can you see how thin they are because it's quite thin you can just pull it out from the fridge but i'm going to put my potatoes in here i'm going to put my onions in here and yeah it's going to be really really good this one is a fridge storage tray and you can see there's a picture of a drink in there so i'm definitely going to use this for drinks for my appetizers and my um, diet cokes and we have this which is a stainless steel door hook and i thought i could use this for you know the undy um so this is the stainless steel door hook and i really wanted to use this for where my sink is the cupboard underneath it where there's the cleaning products that's where we wash our hands most of the time so i wanted to use this to put my hand towel there so when you finish washing your hands you dry them immediately you don't need to run to the other end get the hand towel and wipe your hands or sometimes i keep the hand towel somewhere else so when the kids finish washing their hands they don't do that they just wash their hands whoosh, water all over the floor so i thought if it's right there next to them that doesn't happen <laughs> we have these latte glasses and these were only believe it or not for two for a pound yeah this is how they look oh the lighting has gone so bright all of a sudden hold on this is how they look Ooh. <sighs> mm. for a pound for two of these really good i'm very impressed with that have some adhesive hooks so you just stick them on and um hang whatever you want so i'm going to be using this for light frame so i'm going to be using this for my cleaning cupboards when i want to hang up some towels to dry or anything like that we have some super glue because my mop my valida mop is it called valida and um, the long bit it snapped Oh, it came out of place so i'm gonna super glue it on <laughs> some birthday bits um so this says happy birthday in gold giant balloon birthday buntins and we have a big happy birthday badge that i was meaning to use for my lip. i bought these two a very long time ago by the way <laughs> from home bargains but you can still find it i'm sure um yeah so i haven't managed to use it on him because i forgot in all honesty i totally forgot it was in the bag so i'm gonna use it for my husband waste not what not um so if you watch my videos regularly and you are subscribed to me and you enjoy watching them you know that i film quite a lot of bulk cooking videos to save myself time especially with a hungry family i don't want to cook every single day i just don't it's not my thing i don't really enjoy cooking i cook so that i can eat good food so that my family can eat good food so that we can have homemade meals delicious ones i know how to cook but i don't have to enjoy it <laughs> okay i don't so i like to get it all over and done with in one day and then have food for the rest of the week haven't got to think about what we're eating so i bought this so this is those little takeaway um foil containers with lids how many did you get in here oh yeah how much oh yeah 16 whoops uh for 1.99 i bought that for the meals i'm going to create so i'm going to film that for you guys of course i have three super absorbent tea towels that i'm going to use for my hands i don't dry my plates no i will never do that <laughs> just leave it there and let it do its thing and then i have some lint rollers that have been opened by maybe liana 
because there's two more there. Okay, so that is my organization little home bits out of the way. Let me show you guys the cleaning products I have. We have some sponge scourers. We have this amazing Fabulosa uh, disinfectant spray in unicorn dust, which kills 99.9 .9 bacteria and viruses. Let me tell you how amazing this smells. I can't tell you, you're gonna have to go smell it. <laughs> Why I said that, I have no idea. If you've never bought this before, I think they're a pound. You can find them at Home Bargains, B&M, any of them shops, Poundland, if they exist. Do they still exist? Yeah, unicorn dust is the scent. I was gonna say flavor. <laughs> we have this uh, Mrs. Hinch's Winter Edition Lenore in Rose Wonderland. I love these so much. I need to go stock up. And I also like the pods, which I've bought and used. Because, you know, I've got to wash clothes. We have some fairy all-in-one. Apparently, it's um, the scent orange. But I've used it just yesterday. And I'm telling you, I didn't smell anything. But apparently, they're meant to be really, really good. There's 60 dishwasher capsules in here. We have another of the Fabulosa. Um, oh, my goodness. No, guys. I don't know about that unicorn thing because that super tricked me, okay? Because they're both pink. I thought it was the same thing. I don't even know how this smells now. I just picked it up. No, it's nice. Super nice. They're both nice. But this is the one I meant. This is the Electrify one. It's so good. They're really good. Grab them when you go in next time. And then we have your typical Zaflora in White Blossom. I have my favourite, which is Country Garden. I've used one of them already. It's downstairs. Yesterday I came back and I had to use it. Uh, Fabulosa Disinfectant in Frosted Berries, which smells quite nice. And I think these are cheaper than the Zafloras. I'm not sure. And because I like the smell of the Zaflora white blossoms so much i bought two i did buy two yeah i use this dettol washing machine cleaner whenever i wash my clothes i just do and it washes my uh, washing machine kills bacteria prevents bad odor removes lime scale removes hidden dirt and it leaves my laundry so good really really fresh another cleaning bag here we have this febreze ambiper three revolution refills and this smells so nice right it's called white jasmine and i think oh yeah it's two pack fabulous i just love these so much you can't beat them the plug-in ones i have fabulosa tranquil haze wow i have a lot of cleaning products and then i have this pledge dust it i've been looking for these in tesco someone tell me if they've been discontinued in tesco i couldn't find them for the life of me and we have the pink stuff miracle multi-purpose cleaner which i've never used before i love the pink stuff in general the tub my favorite but i haven't used this let me know if you guys like it and we have good old elbow grease which if you haven't used before what are you waiting for you can use it on so many things your clothes, your metals, your plastics is an all-purpose degreaser. It works in everything. Oh, this is an exciting one. So I bought two of these. One is downstairs and it is the Febreze Unstoppable Fabric Refresher. And it smells so good. I haven't even turned the nozzle. I can smell it. I think the bottle smells nice. Wow. So yeah, this is um, basically my favorite spray, which comes like this. One of these but in a fabric refresher form so i pretty much use this on my clothes okay i used the one that came in one of these spray bottles on my clothes i have one in the car <laughs> i use it as my perfume yes i do it smells so good it's my favorite the unstoppables blue one but i bought this yesterday the febreze air mist in floral gardens which smells Oh, it's so refreshing and very florally, <laughs> if that even makes sense. And this I saw on one of my friends, Nadouche. I think her name has changed now on Instagram, but Makeup by Nadouche, yeah. So she bought this and she shared it on her stories and it is the Crocus and Bluebell and it smells so good. So this might be my new perfume. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> Honestly, if you can use it on um, your curtains and things like that, what can you use in your clothes and your hijab? Bin liner, which is interesting. This elbow grease paste, which looks like the pink stuff, right? 
but I've never used it before. I feel like it's gonna be the exact same as the pink stuff because I use the pink stuff on everything and I'm very excited to use this. I haven't bought another pink stuff because I wanna see what this is all about. I'm saving the best to last. I am. Surprise a bath bomb for the kids when they're having a bath. Femme Fresh Freshness Deodorant. And you know what Femme Fresh is if you're a lady? I have been obsessed with these foam bursts body washes. So you just press it, it foams up like a big foam. And I just love using it on my body. It smells so delicious and it's my new favorite. I don't use other ones anymore <laughs> because you know, we've leveled up. <laughs> we use the foam stuff now. And then I bought this um, eyelashes. That is how they look. Yeah, they're very, very pretty. Miscellaneous things such as baby oil, which I like to use for melting off the makeup of my face. And then I just wipe it with one of those um, microfiber cloths. The baby oil is really good. It doesn't break me out, nothing. And then we have this got to be oil licious. Time to shine, styling oil for instant sleek and glossy style with argan oil. I use this on myself, the kids. I just put it on my hand. Um, comb it through my hair when my hair's wet and leave it let my hair air dry I have these body legs and arms wax strips which was so cheap I think 99p and I wanted to try them and see what they're saying I was saying to my husband let me use it on you because he's my guinea pig obviously and then I have these French manicure set nails which I always share with you guys anytime I go home bargains they look so natural but they're a bit too long for me so i always file it down and it makes it look like my natural nails so when i'm on a period i do put these on which i should do right now rosy glow eos revolution smooth lip thing and it's just a little ball just for hydration let me just tip it all out we have another surprise a fizzler and this is a pink one liana will love that micellar water which is standard i pick up any old micellar water these two are my favorite um, shampoo and conditioner and i also have the leave-in conditioner i use on the entire family the kids use it but the kids don't use these these are really clean um shampoo and conditioners they're 98 percent natural ingredients and i really really love this range from garnier so if you've not tried it before in home bargains they are 3.99 and um in boots and all other places i think they're 6.99 yeah maybe 2.99 even don't cut me on it but yeah i'm telling you they're cheaper in home bargains hi <gasps> Okay, oh, he's so sweet. Thank you. And a snack. I don't know if you can have it now. What is it? Thank Two you. Two different things, just in case you don't like it. That's so kind. Bless. Bless. They went to do a little errand for me and pick up um, some bedding I bought for the kids from Argos. So they must have done a little detour and went and bought a bunch of stuff from Costa because the kids love the cheese and tomato sandwiches from there and they love the hot chocolate. Mmm. I feel like this is like coconut milk or something. But it's nice. What is this? Mmm. That's a good hot chocolate. But I feel like it's coconut or oat milk, which I didn't think would be nice, but it is. You know what? I might as well just see what's in here, okay? I was going to leave it to later. So we have... Ooh! A lemon uh, muffin, which is so nice, if you love lemons. So this is not supposed to be a Costa haul, but obviously... Oh, brownie! My husband's trying to get me fat. So, guys, we are on the last two items. No, let me just show you this. Okay, Sudocrem. Bye. Save the best to last. This is so exciting. I bought this for $8.99. Okay, it is a mini ring light. $8.99. Sorry, what? The only issue would be if the light doesn't change because right now I'm seeing a bit of a yellowy type of light. I'm hoping that you can change it. Oh yeah, there's three modes. Uh, there's a yellow, you know, and there's white. Yeah, there's three modes. USB powered, cord control, guys. And it also has a phone holder. 
LED desktop light with phone holder. Why did I just read that? <laughs> $8.99? Go on Amazon now and I promise you, it will not be $8.99. I'm so chuffed that I picked this up and it's a good size for my desk. My computer will be there, this will be there. I'm able to chat to you guys on Instagram a lot more. I kept the amazing item till last. I'll show you guys how it looks once it's hanged up as well and decorated. Yeah, sorry for the reflection. There we go. That's how it looks. So, I have, not um, I have no clue how much this was. I left my receipt in my car. Um, but I'm pretty sure it was like $14.99 maybe. But it was so good for $14.99. That's how it looks. I'm going to go set that up now. I want to put it on top of my uh, radiator rack in the bathroom and I also have some frames for the bathroom that I bought from the range about two years ago that I've never gotten around to putting up I've had it for that long my husband accidentally smashed one of the glass so yeah this time I'm gonna do this straight away so I can show you what it looks like so this is the last item I picked up I hope you guys have enjoyed um, this video oh no I'm lying I didn't show you the kids stuff so I got this uh, pack of 10 mini play-doh from B&M for £3. I got some kinetic sand. Listen, why am I always that mum that likes to buy things that make the biggest mess? My husband always says this to me. But this morning I was playing with it. It was so therapeutic. Kinetic sand, better than play-doh, I'm telling you get it you adults are gonna love it more than your kids <laughs> well the kids loved it too but i found it so therapeutic i'm definitely gonna buy it again but i'm just gonna show you guys a clip of the aftermath when you leave the kids alone with it don't leave a toddler with this the older kids sure but not a toddler she left it all over the floor but it was a quick clean up it made her happy and i'll buy it again just that bump <laughs> and then last but not least i have this timetables um thing i bought from alec and it is really good. It comes with one of these pens. Go and wipe it off. And um, it's really, really good because it gives you um, this little t numbers pattern so you can explain to him how to do the timetables. And also, it has loads of different equations with photos of houses. It's really, really good, I'm telling you. It was only $1.99 and the RRP is $5.99. So with homeschooling, I need all the help I can get, okay? I'm losing it. I'm literally losing it. I hope they do go back on 8th of March, I think. But yeah, that is definitely the end of everything that I picked up on my massive home bargains and B&M shop. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Let me know in the comment section below what your favourite item was. My favourite item has to be the ring light and this um, shelf thing definitely a bargain and i'll catch you in my next video take care bye let me do a facetime with my husband he's only downstairs <laughs> mm. i didn't think that coconut milk would be this good thank you for this no. is it coconut milk is it good is it coconut milk? No, I can't tell you, but is it good? Yeah, it's so good. I can't tell you, but is it good? Yeah. Really? Yeah, I like it. I'm glad you like it. Is it coconut milk? I'm glad you like it. Is it coconut milk? It is. I knew it. Oh, it's so nice. It is. It's nice. It's really nice.